Welcome back. Hard to believe there are only 24 days left in this year. Where has it gone? It gives me some anxiety. I oh didn't realize gosh. we were so close. Yes, with Christmas here. In fact, for some folks, it can be an exciting or sentimental time and just merry getting ready to celebrate the holiday. But for some folks and some families, it's not always cheerful. Our campus correspondent, Addie Crawford, joins us live in studio talking about how the end of year is going for college students. Addie? Good morning, Robin and Lacey. For most people, the last few weeks of the year is a joyful time, but for college students, the first few weeks of December are neither holly nor jolly. Instead, this time of year is all about finals. Inside of Bazell Library's doors, the pressure of finals weighs heavy. I would describe finals week as stressful. See, my thing is, oh gosh. Students prepping hard for the biggest exams, papers, and projects they'll have all semester. Generally, that last assignment means a lot to the grade. Everything is on the line. Like, it could literally drop. For example, our grade, if we, if we don't get over a 50, <laughs> we, our grade goes down from an A to a C. Where reviews or study guides aren't guaranteed. It's about 50-50. I have about half my professors actually give me like a list of terms at least to remember, like things to remember for the final. And then I'd say the other half just say, you know, review everything from the semester and do your best. Gaylord College's Associate Dean of Students emphasizes the importance of talking individually to instructors and utilizing everything OU offers. The university as a whole has some great resources, obviously the library. There's also a writing center here on campus to help with papers. So there's lots of resources here on campus. And to all college students. Good luck on all your finals. Dean Walker said she tells all students to not stay up all night studying and cramming, but to get more than enough rest to ace that test. In studio, Addie Crawford, Oklahoma Zone, News 9. Back to you guys.